I can't help but laugh when I hear Shadow Clone Barbarian Jutsu in four times speed. Hey guys, this is Andre and welcome back to another Let's Play episode. Today we are going to be upgrading a ton of stuff and clearing some of these trees out of the... Is that a gem box? Yeah! Gem box, gem box, gem box! I am getting pretty up there with gems, so hopefully I get something from this trunk. Unfortunately, I didn't get anything from the tree, but the gem box is going to give us 25. And this sweet victory achievement is going to give us plus 10, so I have 1,509 gems. I am really, really close to getting that fifth builder, and I might go for that sweet victory achievement and get another 450 gems. I'll definitely make a video on that and show you guys how to do it. But with the gem box, boom, an extra 25 gems. So I have 1,534. We're going to be upgrading our wall breaker to level 2, which will give us another 160 damage for walls and cost 500 extra elixir. So I'm also going to upgrade some of these walls so I can use my gold, and then we're going to go out and farm some resources so make sure to stick around because we have some big loot raids coming up so let's hit that attack button and see who we can find oh yeah that's what i'm talking about we'll be attacking ms today and she or he has over 200,000 resources for us everything is in the pumps and mines because we can see that they're exactly equal in gold and elixir so it's awesome that i have barch and that they have all of the resources on the outside so i just throw my barbarians down throw my archers down and let my barbarians take all of the hits and just soak up all of this juicy loot. Look at this. It's so beautiful. And that is honestly why I love Barch because it's so easy to do. I thought I may be able to take out this town hall, but at the end I didn't really care that much so I just surrendered since I wasn't going to get any more elixir or gold. And on to the next one. For the next one, we'll be attacking Gardo versus uh, I don't know how to say that. But they got a good amount of loot, and it's all on the outside again, all in the pumps and mines. And I have Barch once again, because Barch is life. Guys, in the comments below, do hashtag Barch is life if you agree. Because honestly, Barch and all archers is just so easy to do, and you get so much loot from it. It's so quick and easy. It's just awesome the only downside if you could actually call it a downside is that you max out on elixir pretty quickly since you're not using very heavy elixir based troops but it's honestly too easy you put a line of barbarian meat shields then archers right behind them and you just collect all the loot it's that simple so we got 212,000 loot from this raid and we're gonna head back to base and start upgrading some stuff so in our last raid, we got an achievement for Wallbuster, which means we destroyed 100 walls, and we get another 10 gems for that. So we got 1,544 gems. We're going to start off by upgrading our air defense to level 2, which will give us another 30 damage per second, upgrade our elixir storage to level 8 so we can max that out, and I was thinking about upgrading our cannon, but we can actually max out all of our walls. So I am super excited for that. We have two walls left, and this is the last one. Yes! 10,000 gold, the last wall we need to upgrade. For this town hall at least. So we're going to upgrade our cannon to level 5, which will max it out for this town hall level. And we are going to upgrade our barracks because we have way too much elixir. I might start having to use some other composition besides barch so I can use more heavy elixir stuff. So we have all of those four things upgrading right now, and I will see you guys in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to be subscribed, like, and comment for a chance to win some gift cards. Alright guys, peace! Get, 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 no,